Hello guys and welcome back to another Feed the Beast Infinity video and as you can see a lot of stuff been happening yeah that's right that's right I've got a lot to talk about because um, we are going to do today um, some fancy stuff and I need to yeah I need to do this because it's screaming in my headphone so uh, what's been happening what's been happening first of all um, here is kind of nothing uh, I get rid of those huge trees if there were in the first episode I don't, I don't know I'm not sure I'm really not sure uh, as you can see <laughs> I kind of uh, have a loads of saplings and uh, I have a QAD and a lot of a um, lot of ages with the books, and uh, yeah, I've got the Vivern armor. As you can see, it's like a super armor and tools and this capacitor, and yeah, it's holding 80 million RF. That's that's amazing. That's amazing and. Believe me or not, it took a while to actually charge this up with uh, just this. Uh, it was like, yeah, a huge, huge, and I don't have a power again because I've run out of the, the coal. So, yeah, I have something to show you. To so, first of all, we are going to go into the mining world. And voila, bam, we are in the mining world and actually this is the world that I wrote. So as you can see, there is like everything you ever want for mining, even dense ores. And yeah, um, you got a weakness, but it doesn't matter, it doesn't matter. And here is our quarry. Yeah, that that's right. That's right. We have a quarry, and it's doing amazing job. I set it to be kind of huge, I guess. And yeah, it's it's one hundred by one hundred blocks. Um, I think so. That that's that's a huge space to actually mine out, and it's doing pretty well. As you can see, I've got here um, the nether tank or ender tank and it's pumping lava into those generators and they are they are barely keeping up with this quarry but yeah it's it's going good, good it's doing a good job and as you can see I'm getting a lot of resources so let's just head back home and the next thing that I want to talk about is this thing right here because you know uh, I've been running out of cobblestone yeah you, you are seeing a new stuff I will be talking about that soon and I've been running out of cobblestone and you can see I've been crafting some compressed cobblestone and yeah I need a lot of it so this is actually like farm because if you take if you take uh, those uh, transfer nodes and you actually give them more interaction interaction updates, uh, it will actually mine this cobblestone without breaking it. So it's like an instant mining uh, with the cobblestone. So yeah, that, that's awesome. So I set it up and uh, it's doing a pretty good job. I have a chunk loader somewhere here. So it's okay. And as you can see, I've upgraded our storage systems. So yeah, I, I'm going to upgrade it more. But uh, yeah, I've got this deep storage unit for some things. And I need for, um, for gravel because I'm actually um, getting a lot of gravel from the quarry. And uh, yeah, as you can see it uh, this quarry is doing pretty good job so i'm i'm very happy 
and we're very happy and very satisfied with that and right here uh, you can see it's just a preparation for our spawners so it's kind of like a nice area where we are going to build some spawners but before that we need a lot of energy and lava tank or the uh, ender tank with lava pump um, it's just not enough and actually I can't store the energy the energy that I have more and there's one more thing that I want to show you um, this is my oh, uh, glitching with the speed uh, I'm all the time glitching in the walls uh, this is my kind of XP farm so as you can see I've got this those uh, bushes I don't know how they call but uh, it's collecting there's a harvester somewhere and it's collecting those things Concent concentrated essence berries yeah and uh, when you eat them it will actually give you an XP so that's awesome so I've been uh, kind of automatic uh, I've been doing some kind of automatization uh, with this so it's actually collecting uh, the berries automatically and yeah it's getting a bigger bigger area than this is so that's why are those berries still there so yeah uh, so I've been talking about energy and we need a lot of energy uh, like a real lot of. and for that uh, what I want to do is that I kind of want to build uh, you know nuclear reactor yeah yeah that that's right that's right so I've got everything prepared right here well not everything because I've got not so much those vibrant capacitors they can hold 25 million RF so uh, it's not it's good it's 50 million uh, but yeah you know uh, but they are so so expensive they are so expensive you need to uh, craft those vibrant alloys and with for um, the ender barrels and I'm kind of short on the ender barrels right now and you know you want you need this octetic capacitator and those words uh, yeah and it's taking a lot of resources and you need those and those energetics alloys are actually pretty cheap uh, for me uh, so yeah that's not a big deal as you can see I've been crafting them um yeah and the first basic it's it's cheap this is those those are cheap and yeah there uh, here you can see they are kind of like um smaller smaller ones so i could click on them yeah those are the smaller ones so yeah it's uh the deal is that I don't want uh, the smaller ones because you know I want to craft the bigger ones uh, in the first place. So we are going to get rid of those things like this room and this room, and I need to kind of shift those stuff that don't belong here somewhere else. Um, I know that the greedy will be in this room when we get rid of this blaze spawner and actually it's doing a pretty good job uh, so yeah and uh, what we are going to need so in the first episode I told that I will be kind of doing like um, small tutorials or kind of uh, know-how videos for you so you need a reactor chasing and it's pretty pretty straightforward thing you need a yellowium or uranium ingots. You need those graphite bars, and actually this is pretty cheap. You take a uh, charcoal or coal and you just smell it. So, yeah, that's pretty cheap. And uh, iron ingots. So, that's pretty straightforward stuff. Uh, this reactor glass, it's not needed, but yeah, you know, yeah, I want to kind of see into the reactor. Uh, so you need this uh, reactor chasing and those 
pieces of glass it's easy reactor controller is yeah reactor chasing some yellowium a diamond and redstone then you need the yellowium fuel rods this is like the graphite bar yellowium or uranium and iron a uh, reactor a uh, reactor control root um yeah it's pretty straightforward stuff for this you need the piston and uh, n nothing nothing expensive not nothing expensive so far and i showed you those uh, capacitors banks so yeah they, they are they are pretty pretty hard to actually craft uh this is like an emerald and with these vibrant allies it's it's not that cheap so yeah uh i will be tearing down this room and as you can see i kind of have like this theme right here and i want to kind of continue with this theme i i love those and infused obsidian blocks yeah uh i just i just love them and i want to kind of have like you know a passage ways something like that uh yeah you see automatization um so i want to c kind of continue with this theme so i will be tearing down this room and uh what i want to kind of have is like the one room with all those machines and with a room for another ones and then behind that i want to actually kind of have like a new room with the reactors so yeah i will tear this down and see you in a while guys okay guys so you wanna see that you wanna see that yeah yeah all right so this is the design for the room with all those machines and furnaces and uh you know uh just with all that needs power and um i want to kind of have those machines uh on this side and that side and in this corners or in this uh small bits i want to have a diamond's chest for you know just items that i don't need or i don't um or well uh after after something uh this chest will be something for those things that i actually need regularly and um you know uh i i need to i need to think about that and uh this this is the entrance to the reactor and uh let me grab some torches so you can actually see something uh so this is the entrance to the reactor and the reason why i didn't finish the floor is because i kind of i'm kind of short on oh yeah this is the chest with the items uh i'm kind of uh, short uh on the obsidian uh infused obsidian so i need to actually go and farm some uh eyes or the ender barrels and the eyes of enders um you know i'm just now i i don't need that so much so that's not a problem and i can actually replace this floor with this so it's kind of finished a little bit oh my god I, I sometimes i hate this armor you are so fast in it and you jump so high it's oh it's sometimes sometimes it's not good uh so yeah so this is the room and uh all those machines will be kind of covered or uh partially covered you know so uh, what I want to do now is to kind of build uh, a room for the reactor and I want to start building the reactor and I'm using a lot of those factory blocks they are uh, kind of cheap uh, you just take uh, no I didn't want that I want this uh, it's just stone and iron and you actually get like four uh, I guess I've got uh, closer than 26 stacks of them 
So that's awesome. And I'm kind of checking uh, on our quarry um, time to time. And we've got a lot of gravel. And I'm actually going to need uh, um, this, uh, uh, this clay. So, yeah. Uh, right now. I will start working on this, uh, you know, because I can't put those machines in here yet. Uh, I um, I want to kind of have a room for capacitors, and I think the room for them will be like a first, and then another entrance into the reactor. So yeah, th this this will be kind of crucial. Uh, let me actually grab those. And I need to clear my inventory uh, quickly, just do that. Now I can put this, and you can see the quarry is actually working, so that's awesome. And let me actually just, and I need to disable this. Active, great. So, uh, the reason why those two are actually kind of charged uh, is because um, yeah it's because uh, this thing actually charged them so I want to have like a room I kind of want to be it like this bam bam oh my god this is awesome so now you can well, I can charge my equipment. Uh, I love that you can actually see that you can actually see um, the capacity that you have and right now we've got a 50 million RF uh, maximum storage. Uh, I want to have this bigger, much bigger. And I want to kind of go, uh, I want to kind of have like three wide thing and to go like for back, you know. And on the other side, I want to have the same thing, but only just for looks. So like, uh, there will be like a three by three actual size. So it would actually look like this so there will be like three by three completely charge or i think uh it could be completely charged um for just for a look you know and then the entrance for the actual reactor so yeah th this could this could work and um you can configure it this to actually have an output somewhere this this is this is awesome and i will have i will use those 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 cables where i've got them yes those transfer node and uh, hyper energy transfer node you know uh with the ender receivers and the uh, transmitters so i should so i can actually just put a uh, this cable somewhere and transmit the energy through the end or through the void uh, i don't know how it's actually work uh from this so i don't have any wires i don't have any like new kind of furnaces or kind of source of energy i will just have all of it right here so yeah th this this will be awesome uh so uh i will i'll try to Kind of make this room look nice and I, I was I was thinking about some block I, I could, I'm not sure what I block want to use but uh, yeah I, I, let me quickly grab a chisel I want to kind of try those blocks oh they do not connect this this is not good that they do not connect. No, I I don't want those. Um, let me just try that. Oh, this this look actually nice. This look nice. 
and I need to move it one further so I can show you what I want to do so let me just quickly turn this pickaxe to 3x3 three three mode and right like that and yeah um I want this to be right 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 here no maybe maybe I need to take this thing and actually put it uh, and I need a hammer and uh, just do that nope 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 no thank you not you not you not you Yes, I want you. I want you. So I can now just put them like this. No. Um I want I want um I want this right here. Yeah, it it will do. It will do. So I will finish this room. <laughs> you just saw my Kind of session of thinking um i'm struggling with building in mode so yeah uh, i will do i will finish the room and uh, catch, catch you in a while all right guys so this room is now finished and as you can see i add some details those wirings are here just for the looks you know because i i want this to Look nice and there's a stone block so let's quickly replace that and I want this to look nice so this is kind of uh, wiring everywhere you know and this look like kind of maybe some microchips or microprocessors um, yeah it's it's all about the look so you can see the wiring uh, down the floor and the ceiling it's a whole bunch of it and there's one like uh, to this room and uh, you know and the next wiring will actually not be only for the look because we need to start working on the reactor so let me just quickly clear this area a little bit more and uh, I will place some torches so you can actually see. Okay, so I want this, this reactor to start on this level. So, place two blocks like that. Then quick clear that. And uh, one, two, three, four, five. One, two, three. And we need to clear more four. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, that's enough. And yeah, I will clear my inventory quickly. Uh, I can send this two and two. Uh, so, one, two. Let's clear this. One, two, three, four. Yeah. Uh, so, this is the floor of the reactor. Now we want to go one, two, three, and uh, I need more space. So just quickly clear this, and it's one, two, three, it's four, then four to the side, and this is like the basic um, reactor that you actually want to build. So, yeah, uh, I'm like that, and, uh, oh, I, I don't, no, 
I'm missing one more block. That that's unfortunate. That's unfortunate. Um let me just quickly no. Um yeah, I need uh I need this and I need I need the Allurium. I think two will do the job and some iron. I don't have I don't have that much iron. That's unlucky. So let's quickly grab some because our quarry is working while we are doing something else. Uh yeah, I want to open this. And uh yeah, you can see it's working pretty nice. Um even a gold uh, I I'm short on a gold so I will need a lot of gold yeah uh the bronze or the copper I need that okay so let's smelt let's smelt this iron and we can actually craft in here so like that and bam 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 yeah we've got it Okay, thank you very much, and uh, we can sort that in inventory. Okay, so let's finish the reactor. So this is like the basic casing of the reactor. Right now, uh, yeah, I, I've got enough. Uh, right now, I want to place block like this. Oh my god. Oh my god. Um, okay. Okay. Never mind. Never mind. Two. One. Two. One. Two. Two. Bam. All. All right. And uh, like that. Bam. And now we want to place this reactor control rod. Uh, right here. Okay, uh, I don't know what this means. Never mind. Uh, let me just jump here, and now we want this glass reactor glass, and the bam bam bam. Hopefully, I've got enough. Well, it looks like I have enough. Okay, and we want this to be you. Bam, 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 like that. Now we want this reactor console. Yeah, that's right. And uh, right now it's not doing anything. And we want uh, this to be our output. So let's quickly break this glass. So we want this to be our output and uh, well I need to just think about it quickly and this will be like that hopefully I I've got it right and this will be like that okay 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 um ah uh, let me just quickly um okay there, there's no no thing um, so right now I think we can seal this thing off and now just look at your reactor and it will kind of change its shape bam yeah you, you saw that you saw that. so now this is this is uh, like the 
um, console that uh, you want to that you want to kind of operate the reactor and uh, uh, in the reactor access point shift them. Oh, so I my guess is that right here um, I will be putting a fuel, and from right here it will kind of drop the waste. So yeah, hopefully I got it right, and from that. We will drain actually the power. So let me just quickly test it. Oh, we can take a bunch of yellowium and uh, put it right here. And activate the reactor. Okay. So, energy buffer, we are not getting any energy. I don't think it should do that. Okay, I will just deactivate the reactor and uh, well, well, this should be working. Ah, oh, it's it's. Uh, Nope, it's not working because I have this. Yeah, this is like the... This is like the controller of the energy and... Uh, uh, okay, I'm not getting any energy. Uh well I need to I need to find answers and I will be back in a while. Okay guys, so as you can see I figure out the problem. The problem was that I was using this redstone coolant port. And what it's what it does, uh it actually producing a steam or something like that, so you can use a whole bunch of modes and uh just you don't want that you want to have a reactor access point you want to uh, have two of them like that and this one is actually set to this so what it's gonna do is that uh, this thing will be actually inserting the yellow arm or yellow room, the yellow room in good and this thing will be um, like uh, putting out this waste it's cyanide in good uh, so yeah uh, this is this is done right now so it actually can hold uh, yeah, I can activate that it actually can hold like 10 million RF so that that's great and I need to hook this thing up uh, into uh, our kind of um, into our why is this set? Uh, I don't know. Never mind. Uh, so we need to hook this to our our capacitor bank 
and I think I will do this uh, in the ground so you will actually I I want this uh, and just let me quickly do that I want to have it like this oh no I didn't want to break that one just give it to me uh, yeah uh, I will take that uh, I can replace this with glass and yeah I want this here and uh, this one I want right here and this will actually be set to like that uh, yeah great so now I can put my Eulorium in there and I will actually grab a bunch more of it so that's great that's great so from the one side this will be pumping in the Eulorium and from the other side it will be taking the waste so yeah that that's done uh the next thing that i need to kind of do is to put a wiring uh to our capacitor bank and uh put some nice walls in and i have those lights uh those and if you connect them into a cable they will actually uh mm, distribute light or it, it will just be kind of source of light and I want them to be in walls so it's two say two four six so in every wall two and I think it could look great yeah and uh, I need kind of access point to this uh, to this reactor because we can turn this on by uh, putting those rod insertion yes with this we can actually turn the reactor so I don't want to this reactor to actually be active when we have like full capacitor bank and we are not powering anything maybe like let it run on turn percent uh, because you are not using so much fuel but um, I don't I don't think that I have a time for that in today's episode. So in the next episode we will actually finish this uh, reactor room. Uh, I will try to uh, add more those capacitors bank. And in the next episode what I want to do is actually... I'm not sure. I'm not sure maybe those spawners maybe those spawners down here and of course I will be working in between episode because I just love playing modded Minecraft so yeah uh, maybe we will do those spawners because I desperately need them and uh, we need to collect essence for that so I can show you I've been collecting a lot of essence actually it's it's quite a lot quite a lot yes so how this thing is doing yeah it's it's working it's working that's good that's good so it's still producing the essence uh, it's killing them automatically i think i hope it it done that uh i've got it the wrong yes i've got it wrong i need to just rotate this one two and now it's yeah it's killing them so um this will be it guys for today's episode i need to collect a lot more stuff and you can see i've got a little slime on my head that's that's nice so yeah this will be it for today's episode um uh, it's kind of chaotic and maybe a little bit longer. I, I I really don't don't know what what time is it right now. Uh I mean the video time, so I don't know how long this episode will be. Uh, it could be 
long, 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 you know, so, yeah, uh, thanks for watching, guys, uh, please leave a like if you enjoyed the episode, and, of course, see you next time.